Okay, um, around 11.30 we got a call for uh, a fire in the building. It turns out that um, there was welders working in the sprinkler room and we're about 90% certain that that was the source of the smoke. What happened was there was a lot of smoke created from the welding and they, um, they were working right next to a ventilation system and the ventilation system picked up the smoke and distributed it throughout the whole building. So um, as a result, we had to evacuate the building and basically since that time we've been uh, working on removing the smoke from the, from the building. So we're, we're getting close to completion and people should be able to go back in shortly. All right, and evacuation went smoothly and everything's going well right now? Yes, everything went really well. Everybody evacuated well and uh, the building was emptied and our guys went in and uh, are working on removing the smoke. Yes, sir. So I smelled smoke in the building when I was going from CCT, but I didn't see anything so I kept walking. <laughs> I was walking towards class and all of a sudden Four fire trucks started zooming in front of the building, fo followed by like five cop cars. And I actually had a midterm right now, so um, it's kind of mixed feelings. A little sad about the fire that happened in the bio lab, but at the same time, kind of happy that I'm gonna have to write my test another time. <laughs> I was uh, buying a coffee and I just heard the fire alarm and just left the building. <laughs> and then when I got to the meeting place, the firefighter just came in and just kind of yelled at everyone to get out because the fire alarm wasn't on. And then that's when I left. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I think I smell some I smell the smoke here. I was waiting here, I, 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 I can smell the smoke, but I'm not sure whether it's from the building or not. <laughs> uh, yeah, I got a text message while on the bus. Oh my god! The South Building is being evacuated! I was just studying for my exam, which was supposed to be at 12 actually. And then the fire alarm went off and now we're out here. <laughs> so I just wanted to finish the lecture that I got kicked out of the university. I only have two more minutes to say, okay? Um, actually, I'm just kidding. <laughs> and then I got really excited and hoped that I wouldn't I miss all the fire trucks coming in. So just to summarize, the 12 <laughs> till 2 is not going to happen. And they expect that the building will be open at 1 o'clock. That's all they're doing right now. So everything's under control. Everything's okay? under control? Yes. Yes. Okay. How far, do you know how far the fire is spread? No, no idea. They do haven't given which, us that information. Do you don't know which build, part of the building? Uh, I, I don't want to speculate to be honest. Oh, I can't go in. Sorry. Um, uh, I don't know. All I know is it's the other end of the building and not the front of the building. But that's all I can tell. So there's current news from UTN.